Hello, up for auction today is a Victor aka JVC RD MD5 CD slash M mini disc recorder. Uh, this was never sold here in America, it was only sold over in foreign countries like Europe and Japan. Uh, it was made in 1998. It was actually one of the precursors to the JVC Kaboom Boombox, which was one of the uh, obviously icon of the big bass uh, portable boomboxes uh, from the 1990s and the uh, all the way up to 2008. Uh, this is a fully loaded unit that does not take batteries, and there's good reason for that because it's quite heavy and quite powerful. Uh, it uh, also comes with a remote and uh, unfortunately the, the sound you're going to hear is really not going to pass through to this uh, little uh, HD player here with this little tiny microphone but there are two four inch serious uh, seriously powerful subwoofers on each side of this unit plus it has a uh, a couple of two and a half or three inch uh, mid-range drivers in the, behind these grills. The unit has been tear, torn down and cleaned inside and out. It is in excellent condition except for this little tear down here on the grill. Otherwise you can see that there's a little tear there too but honestly it, it, it's really irrelevant uh, because uh, what you really like about it, and obviously you're going to love it for it, is the sound that it produces. Um, this, you cannot buy this here. It was never sold in America. Uh, it also comes with, uh, you can see down there, there's a voltage converter. This will convert it to 100 volts, which is what it was designed for over across the pond. Uh, right now I have a uh, CDR, which is a mixed disc of music. It will play CDRs, which is nice, even though it's for its age. It has a fluorescent display, which is really nice and very strong. Uh, turn the volume down a little bit. It also has mid range, which is really nice. A little mid range. And treble, which I like to keep all the way up. Also has a subwoofer volume. And now we'll play a little bit of music. Like I say, it won't sound very good through this little m microphone on this recorder, but it's still a very beautiful sounding unit. It gives a run of the money. This will definitely surprise the hell out of you as far as the bass is concerned. I owned at least 12 JVC Kaboom Boom boxes, and these little 4 inch drivers amaze me at how the sound that comes out of them. It's earth shaking. But like I said, I can't produce that through this little microphone. Anyway, they, there's also a mini disc recorder on there. Um, the other day I recorded a little music with it. The mini disc you have to lift the only thing the only problem with the mini disc is you have to kind of lift it a little bit before you put it in because uh, it uh, let's just bring it out and put it back in you kind of lift it a little bit and it'll go in it should read it without popping it back out sometimes it'll pop it back out see now if you lift it a little bit and bring it it's all right something to do with the door I never really looked into repairing it. It's something simple, I know that. But it reads the disc fine, obviously, you can see there. And uh, it will play. This is the same song I just recorded. And you'll see it sounds fine. So it records fine, playback's fine. Just a little issue with the door. You gotta like lift it up a little bit. The sound is fantastic. Sound is also fantastic through the mini disc. Sounds just like the CD, which is great. Um, hold on a lot. Let me show you the remote.
Okay. This is the remote control for the unit. It's in also in excellent condition. It'll also work with kaboom boxes. Yeah, it's vice versa. Not all the functions will work, obviously. But uh, it also has uh, AM FM, and it also goes all the way up on the AM FM dial. Let's see. So we'll stop this. Okay, we'll go to tuner. And use it. Well, there's a jog dial right here. But it, pl it goes all the way up. Let's pick a nice station here with a little bit of music. Okay, right there. The question is, did you say this on the air? Yes, end of conversation. We're yep. good. How's things with you? Good. It also okay. has uh, active no, clear sound, which is the same here. thing from Kaboom. Had that same item. Has a lot of features on here. Um, also, what I'll do is, it's very heavy. Uh, the antenna's intact. The uh, battery, well, there's no battery back, sorry. There's also an aux in. And uh, headphone jack. This is the back of the unit. It's really in excellent condition. A couple scuff marks, nothing major. Uh, the t total wattage is 43 watts. Um, like I say, it's really an awesome machine. I mean, the base is just phenomenal out of this thing. It gives the kabooms a run for the money. Anyway, I'm going to have this up on eBay. You can't find these here, and it works great. Other than a little fiddling with the mini disc, putting it in the slot, uh, I haven't had any issues with it outside of that. But you know, this is something minor that's easy to work with. But you can see the uh, the, the subs on the side here. They're very small, and uh, they're unique. I've never seen subs like these before. The the, pat, the way they're made are just they weigh a ton. And you will notice the sound once you hear it. But anyway, this is going to be up on eBay. Uh, it's going to be a no reserve auction. So good luck bidding on it. And uh, have a good day.